Well, my friends, Sam Adams strikes again. Uh, I don't know. I can't find any high-end beers of his, though. You know, they, they got big special bottles and stuff. And it's like, I don't know. I got to, you know, drink this pissy stuff. Well, I don't know if it's pissy stuff today. Yeah, maybe today. But I don't know. We're going to give it a shot, though. But we got Sam Adams. Oh, no, no, no. We got that one. Samuel Adams. Belgian Session. Oh. 4.3%. Um... A product of the USA and it's, it's kosher. Yep, I learned that. A crisp, refreshing version of a traditional Belgian beer. Slightly fruity, slightly spicy flavors from the Belgian yeast are balanced with by toffee and caramel notes from our blend of malts. <sighs> the hops provide a citrus character that rounds out this enjoyable brew. Cheers, Jim Koch. That does not look like Jim Koch's signature. I don't know. It's a little bit different from the, the other ones I've seen. And I gotta get going. Gotta get going, man. Ugh. Ow! Damn. Idaho. I can barely get it. Idaho Falls Gold, 2005. Winner. Wiener. Uh oh. This looks really clear. Very clear. Not carbonated. Not much at all. It's got some in there. I can smell. No, no, that's me. I didn't fart. Looks pretty good. Crystal freaking clear. Crystal. Crystal. Maybe she's an airhead. Ain't too clear. Smells all right. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah, I think, you know, they got that, I think Belgian beers, they put that coriander or whatever the hell they put in it. I don't care for that flavor. I don't care for it, damn it. Jim Koch, cut it out. I don't know if this is true, but I've seen it before. I don't, know if it, I don't know, maybe that guy was just BSing me. But at the Sam Adams plant, you can drink beer while you're working. Now, I wonder if there's a limit. I wonder, I don't know how they do this. You know, you, you only get like one or two a day or something like that. You'd be Peter Griffin getting hammered, you know. But uh, it's okay, but I don't, I don't care for the, the Belgian, the, the coriander flavor stuff in this. I don't care for it, so, but if you like coriander, you're going to like this. I don't taste any hops at all. Nothing spicy, fruity, nothing what they said. I don't know what the hell they were talking about. I think they were just, just, you know, I don't know. Yeah, it's all right. But, did you know, celery has less calories, has so much less calories, it takes more more cal you burn more calories to eat celery than it actually contains. Sorry to eat bugs. No, wait. Who eats who would do rabbits eat celery? I don't know. I have a rabbit eating my bird seed outside. I was like, what the heck is a rabbit doing out there eating bird seed? So I bought the little baby carrots. And I've been putting them out there. I don't know where where it went. My dog took off after the spot, just chased the hell out of it. But uh did it also Baby carrots, I think I might have said this before, baby carrots are made from uh, irregular big carrots that they won't sell in the bags, you know, they, you know, they carve them down, they get more little baby carrots out of the big carrots. And baby corn is actually baby corn. Yeah. Oh. All right, I'm gonna give this a, a, a six. It's, like, it's not much coriander in it. I've had beers with more in it. It's not much. This is probably a lighter, lightest of all the, the coriander crap or whatever. It tastes like cloves. I don't know. And mm, that's about it. I don't know. I don't think the spot ain't going to like this. I know she ain't. She ain't going to like it. 
because she doesn't like clovey beer, coriander beer. And I think the last time I gave her some, she went over there, smelled it, turned her head, and gave me the finger. Cheers.